Yo, what's going on, you guys? Tavius here, and we're back with another video, baby. Just got done recording my owns, so go check that out in the top right corner. That's the character. She's lit. She's lit. She's lit. But anyway, today we got my guy, Deej. Let's do it. DJ is actually a character that I've been pretty interested in. <laughs> Golly. DJ is traditionally a space control and tricky rushdown hybrid charred character, and it feels like they got his style and personality down perfectly. The first thing I like to do when testing a legacy character is see if some of their classic moves and this track remain, and they most certainly do here. It's worth mentioning that DJ is now a charge and motion hybrid character. His fireball was always a charge. He has a fake out. I don't know if DJ has a reversal. I never played DJ previously. Supposedly he was really bad in four. Like horrible. We'll see bro. He looks cool to me. His air slash fireball and jackknife maximum up kicks remaining as before. Okay. While his sabat dread kicks now are a quarter circle forward and kick input. Oh his no. machine gun upper is also a that is a lot of damage. Is also a <laughs> nah, that, that's impactful. 13 hits. Something the Capcom really honed in on here with DJ is his trickery and feints, with the light version of all the specials I tested being fake versions of the actual moves. Great for baiting out your opponent and mixing them into oblivion. Man, that's gonna be crazy. My dude has fakes on everything. I'm calling it now. I feel like DJ is gonna be a really good character. If he is, I said it here. You can use his light up kick, for example, as an alternative jump. What? A brand new tool for DJ is his Just Cool Sway move, which is a quarter circle back and kick input. The best way I can describe this is an auto shimmy with multiple follow ups. Dang, that's gonna be Light sick. Is a low attack, usable in combo. That's plus two. On counter hit, it's gonna be plus four. If you guys didn't know, counter hits give you two more frames of advantage on hit. Medium kick is an overhead, and heavy kick is a launching kick, which can anti air or start juggles. He also has movement option follow ups too, with forward and punch and lunge oh. and forward with projectile invincibility. Oh man. Allows for a hasty retreat after moving forward with the juggling dash, useful as a feint to confuse opponents after making them think you're gonna approach. Then pressing back and punch during that will retreat, keeping DJ at a safe Bro, did you see him? He did the Michael Jordan finger wave, bro. This guy is lit. A whole host of unique attacks and target calls. Golly, you guys see all that? Jesus Christ. The Marvelous Sunrise Festival. Double quarter circle. Medium punch, light punch, medium punch, heavy punch, light kick, medium kick, heavy kick. He has extensions that he can choose. His level one super is a single. That joint would have got hit. smoked on block. It, uh -huh. on it was a great whip punishing tool for Dalsum. Dalsum with the button. He did this super right here to catch him like this and put Dalsum in a crumple state off of the whiff button from across the map and he was able to drive rush in for a half to one bar and get a combo that junk is gonna be amazing that junk is worth it drive rushing raw half a bar to a one bar is always gonna be worth it for combos i see Dalsum being a pretty good matchup for dj because of that but we'll see though we'll see we'll see level two super is very unique and turns sf6 into a rhythm game okay so i was right here so i guess you choose the buttons that you want to use i'm assuming it's the specifics that they showed it in the combo list that we just looked at. Level 2 Super is very unique and turns SF6 into a rhythm game almost. When I first saw this move in his trailer, I noticed the musical notes and I thought, I wonder if that's some kind of rhythm mini game. And it turns out that's exactly what it is, as you must input the follow ups in order with good timing to land the full damage combos here. Hey, that's crazy. Get the his level 3 looks similar to his Ultra 2 from SF4, with DJ turning up the heat and juggling his opponent. <laughs> There's always at least one character in every fighting game that has the oh, da, 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 type of moves, and DJ's that guy. Overall, DJ feels fresh yet familiar, with a real identity in his tricks and feints. I feel like this might be strong at the start of the game's lifespan, but I hope this won't become gimmicky over time. Tons more exclusive Street Fighter. Is that a reversal? Ones. Not as detailed as the Manon one, but pretty good nonetheless. All right, you guys, that's going to be it for the video. Hope you guys did enjoy it. Check out the Manon one. Check out all the previous ones before this. They're good, bro. It's a lot of footage they released on reversal. Yeah. That's been DJ. Let me know if you guys are excited for DJ. I know I'm geeked. Like I said, Jury. My known DJ are the three characters that I'm geeked for. So we're going to see, bro. Hopefully they're all fun and I enjoy them all. It's Batavius. I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.